Julius, <laughs> what a pleasure to see you again. Congratulations. Thank you. I thought we have to capture this magic moment yeah. in front of the camera, the first volume, and the second, and then the third. Well, I've never seen my own photographs. I've, I've said this to Benedict many times. I said, Benedict, I don't recognize my own photographs. They look so good out of sudden. <laughs> this in Iowa. People all over the country learn about architecture from California. Uh -huh. They saw these houses and these Iowa architects learn that they can do the same thing in Iowa. That's another thing about publishing a book like this. It introduces the public to more and more understanding that architecture is just not one city, one country. Wait, this table. The strips here, that was, uh, they were firm or they were loose? Albert Frey was an engineer. He engineered the forces of the wire from the ceiling onto the table, here and there. And why? Because the forces of that table corner and that table corner would resist like this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you push this, it wouldn't go. Mm -hmm. And he demonstrated this to me with his girlfriend who was at the house that day. And I photographed it. She sat here, she tried to push the table, and I was standing there with the camera. The table didn't move. It's a blessing in my life. I can walk into a building and maybe see a composition that people don't see, even the architects don't see, their own work. I can't believe it. <laughs> I've seen a lot of books, uh -huh. but no one's ever done this before, ever. You are deserving, as a publisher, receiving a Pulitzer Prize. Okay, I'm up for this.